Okay. 0159, 0167, 0159, and if there's no login, it will disappear. Hello everyone, good morning and welcome back to our channel. Again, I'm Eduardo Gulpan and this video guys is connected to my previous daily time record tutorial because one of my viewers her in the Philippines asked me how to refresh the current login after a certain time for example after 5 seconds or 10 seconds of login now there's no other one who log in just like this one guys 0167 Eduardo Gulpan then after 10 seconds uh, this picture as well as all the details will be gone let us wait for a while. Okay, this one. Are you ready? If you are still interested, let's watch this video until the end and please subscribe if you have not yet subscribed. Now let us modify the coding, guys. By the way, if you have not yet uh, have a copy of this database, you can download. Just uh, go back in my previous video and then find the link. So go to the design view. And then let us add a text box. Then um, let's put exit time. Time to exit. Here. Exit time. I'll make it um, black. Make it long. Okay. Now. Let us start the coding here in the scanning of ID. So after scanning, it will add 18 seconds here or 5 seconds. So after clicking, go to event, then go to after update, click these three dots, and then let's put here at that at the last part of the code. So me that exit time is equal to date add. So let us add five seconds guys so is then five don't worry this is a very simple code guys this is a one-liner code so the next parameter is the date so now the current time okay let's check 01627 okay 42 so after 42 but nothing's happened because we're not yet done with our code. So let's go back to the design view. And then let's go to the on timer event. Click these three dots. Then let us continue. So if me um now okay, the current time now is greater than me that exit time, then I will put in if before I forget. Then, uh, me that picture path. This is the source of the picture, guys. Sorry. Is equals to uh, null or blank. Let's check. 0167. Okay. 39. So, okay. It stopped and yet ID number until the time still uh, we can see so we will delete it also so let's go back to our code let's go back to the design let's check so this is ID number employee name entry description and trans time okay so me that ID number is equals to null then made that employee name is equals to null also. Then made that trans time is equals to null. What else? Entry description. Okay. Made that is equals to null. So let's check. 0, 1, 2, 5, 9. Okay. After 57, here we go guys. But never mind about this because it will disappear also. 
All we have to do is to hide this. Okay, no, visible, no. And let us check. 01627. And let us wait. Then, okay. 01259. 01627. 01259. And if there's no lag in, it will disappear. So, the password, guys, of this database is idcell123. So, that's it. That's all, guys. Thank you for watching and see you to my next video.